Hello, my name is James, and today we're going to be going over home position calibration on the DX200 controller. There are times you will need to do a home position calibration. Some examples are if you replace a motor, a drive, or if the APSO data is lost. First, you're going to have to go to your system info icon, then go to security icon, and then in our case, we're in editing mode. You're going to be, you're going to need to go into management level security to complete the next steps. So for this, we're going to hit select, and cursor down to management mode, hit select. By default, it's nine key, 16 times in a row on DX200. After you fill up the 16 characters, we're going to hit enter. Then it'll change to management mode, and you'll also get three keys as well. Now we need to move the robot's effective axes to the its alignment marks, and you can do all or just one. So you're going to want to press servo on ready, make sure that the servo on is flashing, and then pull in the dead man or switch on the back, and then move the robot where the alignment marks will line up. Once complete, you'll be able to see the alignment marks line up on each side of the casting. We will need to go to robot icon and then go to home position icon. From there, you will see the affected axes. Normally, you will have plus or negative numbers, but if you lose your absolute data, you will see asterisks, which you can see all six in ours. So after you move the affected axes to where the alignment marks line up, you'll need to put numbers back in. So to do that, we are going to go to edit, select all axes, and then it says create home position. You're gonna to wanna to check on yes, and then it puts new absolute data in. So once this is complete, you have put APSO data back in for the effective axes. Now you're going to want to go and manually go through your programs and step the robot through each point to verify that the points are still on. If they are off, you will have to go through and reteach those points. Uh, this will conclude the home position calibration on DX200.